Here we go back again with another match day vlog. Yes, it's a match day vlog, and today we're in the small village of Pen Ruddick, a lovely rural little village up near somewhere in Penrith. And Kath is going to be a judge in the local flower show, cake show, and all sorts of vegetables and, and things going on in this village hall. Let's go and have a look at some of the competitors. Or should we say entries? I'm out on my run going through a place called Motherby and it says slow down red squirrels we have lots of grey squirrels in Durham I don't think we have any red ones someone out there correct me if I'm wrong so yes I'm here in Motherby heading towards Pen Ruddick which is this way I believe it is I'm just wandering around different places going for me run and you know, I keep running up people's backyards, keep running up people's driveways, thinking it's a country footpath. No, it leads to somebody's driveway. Penruddick is down there in the distance. I'm going to continue with this run. Yes, so let's hope Sunland can get off to winning ways on their first away venture in, back in the championship. I'm hoping for 1-0 victory. It'll be a tough game. Bristol City, I wish them all the best for the upcoming season, but I hope we can get three points today. But what I want to ask is what flag is that? What flag is that? I have no clue at all. But you know what flag that is? Someone let me know in the comment section down below. Yes, sir. there we go, four mile complete. You've seen what's in the show today at Pen Ruddick. And now we move on to Sunderland. Sunderland travel to Ashton Gate today to take on the Robins. Bristol City versus Sunderland, three o'clock. I'm going for one nil score prediction. It's currently 11 o'clock and well, Team News, there's only one change today. Apparently, allegedly, what I've heard, there's only one change. Ellis Sims. Yes, Ellis Sims is coming to coming into the Sunderland side into a 5-2-1-2 system. And Sunderland drop Embleton to the bench. Now we'll see whether that's um, completely clear when it gets to three o'clock. I will be doing a live stream later on. Well, there you go, Kat. There's your free sandwiches for judging the show. Crazy dog. <laughs> Stuck on your head. What a mad dog. I'm just about to start my live stream. Before I start my live stream, I want to say a shout out to Wincy and Jonas in Benny Dome. Here's their score prediction. Before we get with the score prediction, please subscribe to the channel if you are new. Please subscribe. Much appreciated. Take care, and we'll see you in a bit for the live stream. I will do a review after the live stream. But obviously, on this video, you won't see the live stream. You'll see the review. We'll see you in a bit. Hopefully, three points to the lads. I feel confident we will get the three points with Sims and Stewart starting up front. S A S Sims and Stewart. Hey, sorry. <laughs> Oh, yeah, come on. Hey, Jonas, how are you all day? Yeah. Nice and warm, isn't it? Yeah. What's the score prediction going to be? Uh, 2 0. Goal scorer? 
Jack Clark and um, Sims. Sims? Well, well, I hope so. Yeah. We're going to go somewhere called the pub to watch it. Right, see you in a bit. So there we go. Jonas and Wincy have given their score predictions. I do like that SAS. It would be amazing if Stuart and Sims could score today. It would be a great start to Sims' career if you get a goal today. I hope Sims scores. I hope Stuart scores his first goal of the season. Right, there we go. I'm going to go for 1-0 win to Sunderland, which means only one of them can score. But SAS is on the job today for Sunderland. Come on, the lads. Time for the live stream. Well, you won't see it. You don't see the match review. Here we go, it's finished. Bristol City 2, Sunderland 3. Sunderland have won the first game of the season in the Championship away at home at Ashton Gate. The Robins, I thought would be a difficult proposition to win, but we've won 3 2, absolutely amazing. Goals from Ella Sims scored a brace, and then the winner from Stewart with a header, absolutely fantastic. Now, Sunderland changed the team slightly. We brought in Sims for Embleton. Embleton dropped to the bench, and we went, we went 5 2 1 2. I thought it was a strange decision, but I mean, I'm over the moon. I like when we play two up front. We haven't played two. I mean, when was the last time we played two, two up front? Was it Phillips and Quinn? I don't know. I mean, mine's. I'm, I'm, I'm getting old, I can't remember. But the last time we played two up front was a long time ago. We did it today. Ellis and Stewart, ENS, S and E. Stewart and Sims. Well, the game started off, I think it was the first five minutes. I think it was Bristol City. Goalkeeper passed the ball up to the defender, the defender started to give it a loose pass. Stewart put his toe in, passed the ball to Sims. Sims took one touch, put it under the keeper, 1 0 to Sunderland. I thought, here we go. Great start of the game, great start to Sims' career at Sunderland. I know he's on loan from Everton, but he scores his goal. And then Bristol again equalised it with Vyman. Vyman's a really good player for Bristol City. He's scored some absolutely fantastic goals in his career. The, the, the Austrian player, Austrian striker. He gets the ball, fed into the penalty box, takes a touch, unmarked, one's a peach. And I thought, oh no. Anyway, finishes half time, 1 1. Second half comes out. And Bristol get like a, a really scrappy goal to go 2 1 up. Ball's fed in the box on the right hand side. It touches the ball out of Bart. And it goes under, under Patterson. And it, it might be it's an own goal. I'm not sure. It might be an own goal. I can't quite remember. But it was 2 1 to Bristol City. And I thought, oh no. You know. We, we, I'm not completely, I'm completely confident with our squad at this moment in time. But I have to give the determination and the passion and the drive, the want, the will, the desire from Sunderland players. They did their best. They tried their best. They did. They wore the heart on the sleeves, hundred percent. And that's what you can. That's what you need from a team to really give their all. And we got the next goal with Sims. He slips the ball through a defender's legs, through the keeper's legs to make it two-two. Only four minutes after Bristol going to go in front and I'm thinking absolutely amazing two the peach Sunderland fans go mental to fall over the Hordens and it's a great ground Ashton Gate it, it, it's a lovely ground and Bristol I wish them all the best this season I wish the fans all the best on the travels but the winner the winner what can I say Clark left hand side drives towards the touch line feeds the ball back to, to Pritchard Pritchard floats the ball in the defender from Bristol tries to get up but goes over his head because Stewart's about a foot taller, gets up and heads the ball in the, the right-hand side, top corner of the court to make it 3-2. I am absolutely buzzing. We are winning at Ashton Gate 3-2. We're going to win 3-2. We take the three points. we got four points on the table. And what can I say? We've got new players coming in. Broadhead could be coming in shortly. Four points. Unbeaten in the championship, great start. Alex Neal is doing an absolutely amazing job at Sunderland. He, he changes it around. He changes it around every game. What can I say? We've won. You know, we've won three two. We've got four points. We've won the game of football. The fans going home absolutely elated, and I'm buzzing. I'm absolutely. Thank you, everybody up there who watched the live stream today. You are absolute legends. Please subscribe if you are if you're new to the channel. If you are new to the channel, I've reached fourteen thousand eight hundred and thirty subscribers. We're trying to get 15k. If you're new to the channel, please subscribe. Thank you for Wincy and Jonas for giving their bit. And thank you for everybody out there. You know, it's, it's you who make the channel. Thanks for watching the vlog. Take care. God bless me. God go with you. Man of the match. Man of the match. You know what it is. I'll give it Ella Sims. Ella Sims. Two goals on his debut for Sunderland. What more could you ask for? Take care. And we'll see you probably during the week for the Sheffield game. It's like, thank you.